way too mm. bright. Mm. You gotta do better than this, Tim. I'll hop in the bag. Good morning, guys. Hey there. Hey. So, today, I'm in the back back of the car, if you just saw that little episode. Um, today, I'm going to bring you op shopping with me. Or thrifting. I think, peop I think other people say thrifting. Some people say, is it Goodwill? Secondhand. Op shop. I say op shop. Got it at the op shop. Um, or a vintage, you could go, you know, bougie and say vintage store. But I've been seeing so That's many people. That's blue toilet paper. That's blue toilet paper. Yeah, we've got um, a movie on in the car, Home Alone. <laughs> I've been seeing so many people get some awesome deals. I'm not sure what I'm looking for. I'd love some timber toys. <laughs> I, I look, guys. Look. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, sorry, and the speaker's like literally right here. I hope you can hear me. But yes, I'm looking for, I'll yell. <laughs> I'm looking for some maybe really cool timber toys and I would love some maybe um, like pottery bowls or mugs or things like that, you know? You know, so let's see what we can find, guys. Oscar, you gonna hunt with me? Yeah. Have you got baby Chino on your nose? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, let's see what we can find. Yeah! Aww. That is so cute. Freaky is this? <laughs> I guess people like take take all the Ninja Turtles. Mom, are this? I love floral. I love it. going to be a bit hit and miss I think because we're coming out of the coronavirus thing um, I think they've only just opened up so there wasn't really many little treasures that I found um, there was actually probably more so some really cool furniture like really beautiful timber um, pieces that I saw I don't know if I took footage of that but there was beautiful kind of chairs like dining chairs and tables and some buffets and things that like how cute would that be if you're gonna be really sustainable? So the whole reason I wanted to get into it, late the other night I was kind of down this rabbit hole of um, sustainable living YouTube videos. <laughs> and you know, zero waste and like how can you do better and, and just all of these things. And I was like, I need to do better. I am just the biggest consumer ever. <laughs> 
And I think especially I grew up with my mum really living super sustainably and I mean she's going to get so back to living like that I think when she retires it's going to be great but I don't ever remember having you know crappy plastic stuff anywhere we had timber everything it was always good quality and lasted forever have that for my kids you know so I'll get on with it if you're interested in things like that, I'll list a few YouTubers here that um, really inspire me to do better and I'll pop there, I'll link them down below as well. And a few Insta accounts as well that are really, really awesome. Kind of looking at the couple of things that I did get, Goldie kind of really <laughs> um, got some treasures and that's about it, but I will show you what I got. Okay, so firstly, um, I found this really cute timber drum. Um, you know, it's all timber. It's got this, I don't know, leathery stuff on the top. A little bongo drum, I'm pretty sure you call it. It was, um, I think it was like $4. So Goldie's going to love that. And she's really into dancing and music and things. So I thought that's going to be really sweet, this. And then to go with it, I saw some little maracas. Um... They are in a little plastic thing, but that's fine. Just some little timber balls there with little shakies. So, got a little music set going on there. So that was really cute. That was from the first store that we stopped at. Then I saw, a few times I've been to this one. What, what is it? It's a Save the Children op shop. And it always has really, really cute, uh, like, kids clothes. And it had really cute things like timber high chairs and little dolly um, cribs and things like that. But I got this for Goldie. Yeah, I think it is really sweet. Stop. It's a little, I might take the tag off, little knitted jacket. Oh, well, cardigan. It's got little buttons on it. It's so sweet, you guys. And like the little buttons. Lock one out. I'll down there. Obviously, too, I'm going to wash it. Lay it in the sun. Obviously, um, it's not for everyone. So like op shopping, secondhand things, whatever. I know a few people that kind of turn their nose up. They don't like it. They don't want anything, you know, secondhand, whatever. And cool. That's awesome. But it really doesn't bother me. Um, like I said, I'm trying to be more sustainable and in this one video that I watched it was like you know five ways to start sustainable living was to try to buy secondhand she's got the shakers try to buy secondhand when you can and buy things that are gonna last it's so cute I haven't even tried it on her and then at the last um, there were a couple I stopped at and there was nothing like there was literally not even anything on the shelf so I got this sweet little basket. It was a dollar. I thought it was really sweet. I actually, it's got a little lid. I thought of Everly because she loves to put little treasures and little things. And I thought that would be a really sweet thing like, you know, sitting on top of her drawers or something or whatever. I'll find a purpose for it. It was really sweet. Um, Goldie really loves these little tiny books. And there was just two there for 50 cents sitting there. So, and I'm going to wipe them down. They're going to be totally fine. And she just loves the size of them. So I got two little spots books for her. And then I just got this really sweet uh, teacup for myself. I think it's really sweet. It's a really cute shape. And um, I don't know, I have a peppermint tea or something in it. And it's like a pottery made one. I'm not sure what this means, but that's on the bottom. So someone made this with love, guys, you know? And that's what I mean. There was heaps of little cute um, teacups and things. There were lots of little like milk jugs, gravy jugs. I'm not sure, jug, like little jugs that were really cute. There were a lot of little like casserole dishes in all different sizes and all those earthy brown colors, which was so cute. But I don't know, I'm a, not a great cook, but if I cooked little things like that, I would buy them, you know? So yeah. Oh, and then Oscar just got this little, cause he was being so good, just this little um, bag full of like Hot Wheels cars for $5. These are them. 
with their Hot Wheels. So that was everything I got. I, everything was this much. And um, yeah, I'm really happy with that. I think it's really sweet. So, and I'm gonna try to do, yeah, like marketplace, gum tree, op shops, vintage stores. I'm just really gonna try my best. And don't get me wrong, I like nice things. I'm a shopper. <laughs> Um, I'm a, I'm a consumer, but yeah, I just really want to try to do better. So that was just my little, little thing this morning. I thought I'd bring you with me, do a little shop with me, but thank you so much for watching and we will see you in my next video. Um, and I'm going to leave you with Oscar showing you some of his Hot Wheels cars. Thanks so much for watching guys. Bye. Guys, hi, it's me by myself in my own house. And look at this one. This one is very fast and it even like drives upside down. Look. Hey guys, look, it's a little small. Goldie, look at mummy. Hey. hey! It's a little small, but you know what? I don't even care. She can wear it for like... <laughs> what? You can wear it for a little bit for me?